Hey guys, this is Emmanuel with Funtown RV. I'm a part of the RV ASAP internet sales team here. Today we're at our campgrounds here in Cleburne, Texas. If you happen to pick up a camper with us and you're coming from out of state, this is a great place for you to set up and stay overnight. It's free for all of our customers that are buying new RVs. Uh, today we're gonna be doing a walkthrough of the Chaparral Light. This is a 2023 model of the 30BH floor plan. Now, let's go take a look. All right guys, starting up front, we're gonna have our beautiful new front cap on this Chaparral and that beautiful Chaparral logo that we all know and love. On either side of this front cap, we have some LED strips for docking late at night. We're gonna have our Lippert standard hitch that comes with these fifth wheels here. Moving down underneath this camper, we're gonna see our large storage space landing legs control. This is gonna help us uh, drop and also raise the front of this camper. All right guys, coming along the side of this camper here, we're gonna have some great features that Chaparral included on the 2023 model. First, we're gonna have our outdoor marine grade speakers. Above that, we're gonna have a window. This is a window to the bedroom, the master bedroom, which does open. We're also gonna have a 14 foot awning lined with that beautiful LED strip on this Chaparral light. And then as we come through, we'll see a massive pass-through storage, which you love to see at this price point. Just even more value that Chaparral has added on this model here. And uh, you can also see how we have our aluminum frame inside. This is also going to have aluminum framed sidewalls that do also come with Asdell, which is a rock-proof material. Right here at our entry door, we're going to have our Lippert solid steps. Again, you love to see these steps come standard. They always come in handy when we're at the campsite. I also want to mention that this camper has been rated for zero to 110 degrees and everything in between. So a camper this size, we are going to have dual axles on this unit here. Uh, we're also going to have a large slide out. This is going to hold our dinette on the inside and as well as our couch. Chapra offers these beautiful large windows into our living space to let in all that natural lighting. Coachman also provides us with this ladder that accesses the fully walkable roof here. Just wanted to mention this camper does have two ACs, so this is gonna be 50 amp service on this camper. As I mentioned, here we have our 50 amp plug that is in the rear of the camper this time. You'll also notice two more windows that Coachman Chaparral included at the rear of this camper to let in even more light. We're also prepped for a backup camera up top. All this natural lighting is not gonna stop quite yet. We have two more windows uh, on the opposite side. This camper, you already noticed, has opposing slides in the living area, which is gonna offer a residential feel once we're inside the camper. And take a look at this. You might be wondering why there's two windows in the middle of this camper here. It's because this is a mid bunk floor plan. So two windows for our bunk area. Once again, for all that lighting to come in naturally, they're gonna be shaded on the inside too. I do wanna mention that. This camper is gonna be prepped with also side view cameras as well. So when you're hauling this big rig around, it'd be nice to have those cameras installed to have as much of a view as possible. We have our standard outdoor shower, our water connections. As we continue down the side, you'll see our winterization fresh tank override and some cable and satellite connections. And just take a look at how huge that storage is. This camper has three slides, not one, not two, but three. And we always love to have that bed slide here, Chaparral, decided to include it just for you. All right guys, just before we go inside, I do wanna to mention to like, share, and subscribe uh, our YouTube video here and our YouTube channel. Make sure you share this with your friends and family. It might be a great asset whenever they're looking for their next RV. All right guys, I'm super excited to show y'all the interior of this Chaparral 30BH. I mentioned before, we have opposing slides in this living area here, and it really makes it feel like home. It's super open, super spacious. You always love to see it. Uh, and the, for the seating in this camper, we're gonna have our Thomas Payne recliners. These do vibrate, they heat, and they have additional lighting in the cup holders just for you, and actually down below. Above that, we're gonna have some more storage that comes through on this super slide. We're also gonna have our emergency exit right behind that. Guys, the entertainment setup 
on this chaparral is next level. Check out this huge RCA TV that they include standard. And on either side of that, we have some additional windows for that natural lighting to let it feel nice and open in this camper. And also tucked away underneath that, we're gonna have some more storage space. We can put our VCR, put our CDs, DVDs. Same goes for the other side here, some additional storage space. Down below, we're gonna have a couple things. One, our Furion sound bar. This also doubles as the audio control for the speakers inside the camper and outside the camper. Below that, we're gonna have our 36 inch long Greystone fireplace. This is completely electric and it has utility for hot weather as well as cool weather as this does heat up quite a bit. And also it's gonna have that beautiful ambient lighting. If it's the summertime, if it's warm in here and we just want some ambiance, we have our second super slide, one half of the opposing slides in here. Uh, this is gonna be a traditional pull out sofa. So offer a lot more sleeping here as well as our freestanding table and chairs, which I know you guys love and have been asking for. So Coachman delivered. On the interior, you can see how beautiful the setup is in here with all the windows. Take a look at all the lighting in this camper. In our kitchen here, we are gonna have our island, more like a peninsula setup as it is attached to the wall, but it is gonna have a large basin sink in here. It's not separate, it's one large sink. Uh, also, we're gonna have our high uh, faucet as well. This is all stainless steel, really pretty and elegant, nice countertops. These are gonna be heat resistant for your pans and such. Uh, for this fridge in this camper, it's gonna be a 12 volt Everchill eight cubic foot fridge. So more than enough space uh, in the fridge here. And we're also gonna have our high point microwave, also stainless steel, which is perfect because it transitions perfectly into our Greystone stainless steel that has three stovetop burner and also an oven by Greystone. All right guys, in here you can see right next to our stove, we have some more counter space, perfect for a coffee maker, a toaster, and behind that we'll have a window. And then they included Lots of cabinetry here. This is gonna be real wood cabinetry in this beautiful charcoal brown color. With all this pantry space, you're gonna need some lighting. And Coachman thought this one through. They added some additional LED lights up above. Uh, I am to mention that all the lighting in this camper is LED and it's high efficiency lighting. So it's not gonna kill your, your battery. It's not gonna run all the energy just with the light. So that's a really cool addition as well. So when we have the sink all covered up, the counter space really opens up quite a bit. You'll see even additional space here in this little hutch area, like I said, with even more lighting. This is gonna be perfect for putting our Tupperware, our dishes. If we have our cereal, we can throw our cereal up here. It's just gonna really come in handy when we're camping, especially if we're staying here an extended period of time. All right, guys, and here we are in the middle bunk room. This is gonna be a great spot for the kiddos or for the guests that we have sleeping over with us in this camper. Uh, you'll notice a few things in here. We have an additional emergency exit in the bunk room, which is always a great safety feature to have. This is also gonna come with a built-in uh, kind of dresser, media center, if you will, with a TV backer, some USB plugs, some traditional outlets, and a satellite hookup for dish. It's also gonna have even more lighting here, so that way we're never in the dark in this chaparral. We do have some cubby space up top, so that way we can store clothes, store our games, whatever it is that we're camping with. Take a look at the space in this built-in dresser. This is always really nice to have. Very deep as well. You probably missed it, but I promise you it'll come in handy, is even more storage space underneath this bottom bunk. So that way we can tuck away our bins, tuck away our shoes, you know, and leave some space here in this bunk room. You also noticed how our top bunk folds away. If you wanna have just some extra space for lounging, or if we wanna use this mid bunk, as a storage space. In our hallway here, I wanna point out a couple things. First, we're gonna have our uh, smoke detector right above. And then to the right here in the hallway, we're gonna have our convenience center. Actually sums it up pretty well. It's very convenient because we have switches for our slides. We have switches that control our water heater and gauges for our tanks. So kind of a one-stop type of deal. So that way we can manage all of our electronics in this camper. We are gonna have two access doors to the restroom. This does kind of open up this restroom quite a bit to make it feel a lot more spacious 
Uh, we have our standard porcelain foot flush toilet. Above the toilet, we're gonna have three cup hangers that already come, come installed. And here for the shower, we're gonna have our kind of half circle setup that you might be familiar with. This is gonna be an opaque glass that opens up. We do have a removable shower head in there. Pretty nice setup in the shower. I like it a lot. Coachman did make this restroom feel a little bit more residential with a porcelain sink, stainless steel faucet. And again, we have that standard medicine cabinet and a mirror right here. Some additional plugs in the restroom as well for your hair dryer, straightener, stuff like that. All right, guys. And in the master bedroom, we have some really cool features here at this in this Coachman. One being in this slide out, they have a built-in arm wall. So this is gonna offer tons of closet space. Really, they're not compromising at all when it comes to closet space here as they have these mirrored arm wall with a uh, coat hanger deal inside built in already. And then some more storage space and cubbies to the left of that. In this master bed, you will have one of your 15K ACs that is ducted throughout this uh, master bedroom. Also, we have our we also have our thermostat control in the private bedroom as well. Coming towards the front of this camper, you'll see some additional storage up above the bed. This storage goes across the whole front cap, so it offers lots of space up top. We have our individual reading lights as well above the bedroom, uh, above the bed and the pillow sleeping area. On each side of this queen size bed, we're gonna have built-in nightstands with storage space built in. And again, we have those outlets right above that. We have some more windows in here. We have a third emergency exit and uh, all these windows do have blackout roller shades. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me on another walkthrough, this time of the Chaparral Light. 30 BH. This is the 2023 model. We're super excited to start having this floor plan here at Funtown RV. There's so much of this camper we didn't get to cover. So we're going to add a link in the description for you to check out all the specs and all the details of this chaparral. And if you're interested in purchasing it, you can also find a link to that as well in the description. And guys, remember the fun starts here.